Where the hell am I supposed to go? Hey everybody, White Darkness M40 here, bringing you part 17 of Let's Play Sweet Home. In the last part, we discovered, well, not much. Well, all right. Let me try to see if I can recap what happened last time. Uh, in last episode, we did find out that Yamamura is still alive, and we're almost close to facing uh, Lady Mamiya. Plus, we have lag right now. Also, we discovered that there's a little uh, statue spot around here where you need three candles. The only problem is, is that we can't find the last candle. Now, after running into circle, running in circles, back and forth from different rooms over and over throughout off-screen, and no, I did not level up. I basically just keep, seeing as I wasted a lot of time, I just restarted. I didn't really face that many enemies. That's why I didn't, you know, save. And I pretty much gave up. So I went online and checked out a couple of things, and I found out this. I actually want to bring uh, these other guys over here. There we go. Alright. God, that thing's creepy. Whatever. But it's not going to be as creepy as what's going to happen next. Alright, first off, let's get our uh, team back together. Team out. Alright, team back in. Alright, who has the rings? I think it's... Yeah, alright. Um, I think we're going to switch out the gem. The ruby. Alright, now, what you want to do is this. You see this little... Uh, hunchback of Notre Dame here, right? Alright, so he says, so if you remember back then, we saw, uh, we saw Fresco that told us that, oh, uh, the Master waits for his rings. Now, I guess seeing as we have the rings and, you know, the Master is waiting for them and, or looking for them, or basically seeing as it's the Master's rings, I'm guessing that, uh, he, that it shows that he is the Master. So what we need to do is take a look at the items. The rings are shining. And then pray. Oh, full power. The rings are singing. He speaks. Ah, is that you, sir? I've done as you ask. None have passed. Farewell, good sir. My real question is, where the hell did he go? Who disturbs me? We did not break your child's tomb! Please stop this! Oh. Be brave! She's up ahead. Return to your sleep, Mamiya! Give me my baby! You shall die! A barrier? After all this? Don't worry. I will take care of this. While well, I can't be with you, never un underestimate the power within you. The only way to overcome Lady Mamiya, so long. Be at peace, Mamiya! Be at peace! Grrrr! She... She's strong. But you must be all the stronger. Now, for an NES game in 8-bit, this is pretty creepy. The only pro the only thing that doesn't make this as creepy as it should be is... That's it, it just cuts off right there. I will agree that that is kind of creepy if, like, you didn't see it coming, and I'm guessing you guys haven't either. But, really, if you just cut it off, I mean, the music sounded very sad and, you know, kind of creepy with when you see some guy turning into a corpse. Skeleton. You see his flesh coming off. But when you just cut it off, it just kind of ruins the moment, you know, especially when it just comes back to this music. Anyways. Alright, uh, who has the lower levels? 
Uh, 15. 16. 15. 15. 15. Uh, I guess I'll send these guys first. I was gonna send the weakest members, but I guess that... Your power is mean- are meaningless against me. Where am I? I must have been knocked unconscious. Oh, the fireplace! Yeah, you can see the fireplace is empty. And also, that looks weird. Somebody take a screenshot of that or something. Uh, you could see that Marie, uh, Masayo and Melody were on, or, uh, you know, fused together, and it looked like... It looked like, uh, Melody was, was like, wearing a cop looked like she was, uh, trying to dress up as, uh, Marie Masayo. Oh, we got some bats here, but they're just gonna be annoyance. Alright, we got a new room in here, but I don't think we're gonna take it yet. First off, we're gonna have these guys go get some. As you can see, we have... Oh, actually, no. Actually, we need, actually need these guys. Um, yeah, we're gonna have to take the long way back. Mm -hmm. I don't think it works in this room. I guess it's only a one way. Oh, wait, no, wait, wait. Hold on. Alright, we're one. Really? You die now. Thank you. Alright, if you remember, this door does not unlock for some reason. But, let's see if we have any empty slots. Oh, man, we have plenty of empty slots now that we have that uh, gem, those rings have disappeared. Alright, we take the gold key. Now, the reason why I was like, oh no, is this. As we ha you can see we have a fresco here, but it's covered in dust. Luckily, with this new key, that we can, un we can now unlock this door and... Back in here. Use the gold key again. And then we can um, open this door. And then... We're back in the old area. So it's kind of a little... Just like that little, uh... If you remember in the previous room where we were on, in the basement where there was a... Uh, I was trying to remember. Where there was like... A giant flood, I guess you could say. If you remember, we went back into that room where there was like only a little bit of where there was a uh, uh, little tombs or uh, boxes with the corpses. Uh, you can remember that there was like a little mine cart and a door, and I thought that there was supposed to be uh, like a quick, like a uh, quick reaction kind of runaway thing. Turns out that just like this one, uh, it's like a little shortcut. There's also another shortcut, but I'll show it off later. First off, we need to actually go back and uh, get and get the fresco. Uh, Taro, we're gonna need you. Team out. Team up. All right. Hopefully, we don't get cursed or anything on our way there. All right. Now that we're back in. You. Oh my God! We're fighting a boss. It's Yamamura. No. it's not. That would be actually pretty awesome if we, if like all the skeletons in this. Room. Of course, you would block the way we. Rear. You're a fool. Never mind. Yamamura. We will destroy you. Ha. All right. Now that's been done with. Let's go into this room. Alright, now let's see if we can get that fresco. No. Take a look at it. Alright, use the vacuum. Alright, now let's use the camera. And letters appeared. 7-7. Seven, seven. I need the tool, diary, photo, and coffin. So you're saying I did need that tool. Well, lucky for me, we actually have to uh, go back into that room with the, with the, uh, what was I going to say? Well, with the tool. Ooh, 
Look out, it's the Incredible Hulk zombie. Alright, I think it was... I forgot which room it was. I think it was this room, wasn't it? Oh no, that's where we got the tonic. I mean, where we got the ring, one of the rings. Actually, I think I want to take that tonic with me. The reason why is because I think we're not going to be in this room for a while, so I think it's, uh, if we need to trade out anything, uh, we might as well trade it with tonic, so that way it's in a room that we're close to, you know, just in case. I'm going to just get these things out of our way. Alright, let's see if we can find that room again. Ah, uh, I think it's that upper room. I know there's another tonic right there. Alright. Taro, move that way. And Masayo, move that way. No, you're not. Right back to Melody. Oh, wait. Crap. Uh, she already has an item. Uh, do you, can I make it over here? Uh, who has the bow? I know somebody, I know somebody else in here has the bow, alright. Um, move the tool key over, the two key. Alright. Alright. Is that the tonic? Slide across. Sweet home, on ice! Now 20% more blood. And 20 more percent uh, scar you for life. If you were in the 1980s. Alright, anyways, back into this room. Uh, give me a moment. Okay, sorry about that. Uh, seeing as it's uh, uh, November 1st, uh, for us in for us Spanish, we have to celebrate the Day of the Dead. And basically, we have to... Well, today's the... Okay, yeah, we're, we're celebrating the children and the and adults right now, so, yeah. Anyways, I don't think we're going to need the gem for now. So I think we are, I think that's what we needed. Anyways, here's the second shortcut I was talking about. It takes us back right here, conveniently where we just needed to go. And you're not convenient at all. Go die in a hole. Alright. I think we're this is where we have to start heading off to the fireplace. And lag starts up here. Alright. Really? I took just one step, man. Oh my I'd like to note one thing that this is not a giant. Anyways, ugh, come on, man. Ouch! That hurt me. Wow. Great music. Okay. Gold key. Four doors. Dead. Huh. Okay, so I guess I'm, I guess it's saying that we need to use the gold key in this room in these rooms. I think I'm gonna have to send uh, Mariko and, the, and Honoka instead. Instead, because the, seeing as they have the gold key and the very the areas are very crowded, so it's kind of hard to uh, move with three people. Also, remind me later that I need to uh, heal these guys up. In fact, I'm gonna save right now. Even though I usually do it at the end of videos, I'm gonna just save right now because I do not trust this place. All right. It says they used a gold key. Do we look at it? A gate. Four doors, gold key. 
Huh. So I'm guessing we have to take the slide. Okay. God damn it, man! I cannot take this anymore! Okay. Here we have Ghost. Creative name. It's very scary image. Oh, crap. I don't feel good right now. Ouch. Are they still in there? Huh. Uh, crap. Call. I don't think we can help him. Oh, okay, yeah, we can. Alright, there we go. That helps a lot. Alright. Seeing as Taro has the most tar uh, prey points, I guess I'm gonna have to use him more. I gotta stop now. I think, I think, I think, I think, I think. Uh... I think the only logical thing we can do now is just run. Alright. Well, that saved Honika, but... I think it's a good... Seeing as we have all these tonics, I think it's a good idea we use the tonics right now. Alright. Uh, who has the- who has the other tonic? Masayo, so... Masayo... Why should they have a tonic with them, so... Oh, we have to team back- team back up, alright. Alright, use the tonic. Now go back to Masayo. And give Honika the other tonic. Alright, there. Now we have that out of the way. Let's see what we have to do next. Alright, so what we learned is that we have a new area with creepy music. And we have some gates that we can't unlock for some reason. Hmm, let me check. Uh, we still have the two keys, right? Yeah, move that to Melody, seeing as she has both keys. In fact, I think later I'm gonna give uh, Melody both the keys. Alright. Use the two keys. Nothing happened, and use the regular key. Nothing. Alright, so we- so there's no way past that. Hmm. I'm trying to figure out what we're supposed to do. It says, gold key for doors. And Tara leveled up. I'm trying to figure out... Maybe... Wait, let me take a look at it. Locked. Alright, so... Wait a minute, wait a minute. Alright, before we end off this video, let, uh, let me, I want to take a look at those doors. Because I know there's supposed to, there, we have a couple doors in here that didn't work before. Okay, so that one's still locked. And we still have more battles. A doll. An evil doll, to be in fact. There's only one XP! Amazing. Huh, we haven't seen you in a while. Dead. <laughs> it gives more XP than the evil doll. Were you here before? I think he was. Then again, why would he be new here? Wouldn't surprise me if he was here before. Yeah, he was here before, I remember. Alright, let's try this door. 
Aha! Alright. Maybe that slide that we got, maybe we have to go into a projector room somewhere. Well, that was lucky. Alright. Uh, let's take a look at this. A note. Itsuko, don't come. I will follow. Takashi. I'll follow Takashi. Alright. Take a look at this. A cut axe. Awesome. Alright, uh... Uh, what did the others have? Yeah, I want to. I want to give. Uh, who was it? Taro. Yeah, Taro. I want to give Taro the uh, cut axe instead of the mace. Cause I think I'm still. I still want to keep those forks for Reed for some reason. I don't know. I think I remember them being the most powerful weapon. If they're not, I don't care. But I'll go. I'll do it anyways. Cause I can do what I want. Why? Cause I'm a murderer. No. no. Sound like such a child. All right. I guess this room is only one room, it's just a projector room. So I guess we don't need. We, I guess we're not gonna miss any. So the stronger enemies were hiding in here. Ouch. All right. Switch out that that mace. Whoa. Really? You weren't even here before. Alright, where is she? Oh. Fuck you, game. Wait, let me check that the, if that door is broken or locked. Locked. Got the key? No, I don't. God. together and that we replace the cut axe or the mace. Let's take a look at that slide. Uh, do we have to take a look at this? Yes we do. Alright. Be prepared to have your mind blown by Last Action Hero. Inserted. Huh. Oh, I guess we have to find all the pieces. Who's that? Hmm. Do we pray? Yeah, nothing happened. Hmm. Wait a minute, wait a minute. Gold key. Wait a minute. Alright. I'm gonna before I end off this video, I'm gonna give a theory and see if you guys think I'm right or not. You know, just leave a comment below if you think so or not. Alright. So here's my theory. Well not like about the whole entire story, but what to do next or what we need to do. My theory is that we have to use the gold key to enter a room. I'm gonna guess maybe somewhere near, uh, past the knight's room, like where the court, where the basement is. You know, the flooded basement with all the mirrors. We gotta find a door or something, and then we have to somehow fall or get into the room, again the, on the top part of the, of the of the room, to get that key and those weapons. And I think that. And either the gold key either unlocks the diary, seeing as, you know, it said that we need a photo, which I think is a slide, and that the gold key either unlocks the diary or the key that we need to get, which is in the mirror flooded room, might be there, and probably the other slides or, you know, more information about this is in that diary. So I think in the next part, we're going to have to try to take a look into the... You know, take, take a look around the rooms in, uh, uh, past the night room to see if we can find any more information, or at least find out what to do next. So, till then, if you like this part, check out my, uh, subscribe to, <sighs> come on, my theories are messing me up. If you like this part, subscribe to my videos, white little button, give me a good thumbs up review down, down below this video, and check out my other parts if you like this one. In the next part, I'm going to try not to stutter, and we're going to try to figure out where this gold key will lead us. I will see you guys next time.